Welcome to another edition of Mini Me Crafts. Today we're going to make these super cute glitter dragonflies. Um, you'll get in your in your set you get 10 kits um, and they'll be assorted colors. They come in five different colors so you probably just get two of each color. Um, so let me put those aside and this is what each kit's going to look like. So you get 10 of these and everything you need is inside the kit. Um, to make it so you just want to take your stuff out just be real careful when you don't because there's some small pieces um, So dump everything out of your kit and your tag will be in there as well. I just yeah, Steal that from that one. There you go. Okay, so your tag will your personalized tag and these are free um, With your order. So the first thing you want to do you've got your body These are going to be your wings and then this you've got eyes and your clip and rubber bands all you're um, gonna need is glue and some scissors so start with your dragonfly body and it's already outlined on the back this is just foam so it's very easy to cut uh, cut around your dragonfly body you've got some little bumps and jags you can fix those when you look at it on the front it kind of gives you an idea if you missed a spot or okay. so there's your just your excess um, and so you can kind of look at it it doesn't have to be perfect you see even mine is a little it's that's what makes it cute um, so you've got that and um, I would definitely do your body and your wings first and then the last thing I would do is put your eyes on because they'll need a little time to um, dry for the glue to dry and that way you can leave it set and you're not still having to do something with it. So your clip comes with a, a foam self-adhesive strip or double backed um, adhesive. So just peel that off and then um, I find it's easier to put your dragonfly upside down in your clip and just take your clip and adhere it. Now this is going to adhere pretty strongly so make sure you've got it in the place you want it. I put it up near the top but you can really do whatever you want but it just depends on where you want your wings because your wings will be up here at the top of the clip. Okay so we'll set that aside and your wings are going to be these two tubes here and what you're going to do is one at a time you're going to just fold the tubes in on each other so or the um, ends of the tube I should say. Um, give yourself a little enough slack so that it doesn't pull out and just squish okay so you're kind of making like a figure eight with your tube take one of your rubber bands and just loop it a couple times in the middle there so you're getting everything held together okay and you'll have these little ends that's okay don't worry about that um, then we're going to do the same thing with the second tube Hold it in on itself. Take another rubber band. Loop it around. Oops. I do about three times. It's uh, it's good enough. It will hold. Kind of pull the rubber bands even. Okay. Now before um. Oops. Oops. Let's get that out of the way. Ooh, keep sticking to my finger. Um, you're going to take your two wings now and you're going to put them together. Now, I wouldn't worry. You're going to put them together right in the middle, side, kind of like they're side by side. Don't worry if the wings, don't. they seem to be overlapping and not cooperating because you're going to stretch those out later. So just put those two together side by side. Take your last rubber bands and rubber bands them together. And then you can take, and what I do is just kind of bend them up. Okay, like so. And then what you can do, you've got these little tails. Um, I wouldn't cut them too short, but you can snip them a little just so you won't see them. Uh, but don't cut them too short because you don't want it to pull out and then uh, your wings to come loose and then you've got to redo them. So you've got your um, wings down and you've got your body. And now all you have to do is flip that body upside down, push on the clip, and your wings go right in the top of the clip. I get them up there as far as I can, just so that they won't um, fall out and then they're in the right position. And look at that. 
adorable, right? Um, now, I go so far, it just depends on how much time you've got and where, you know, whether the girls are taking these home right away or they have time to sit. I go as far as putting the tag on before I even put the eyes because the eyes, you know, once the eyes are on, you really need to leave it still just to give them a little time to dry. So take your glue and put a little dab on each eye. You can also put the glue on the body of the dragonfly, whatever's easier. Um, everybody finds it different ways to do it easier than other ways. Let's push them down just a little bit. And see then everything's done and you can just let it sit, the eyes sit and dry. Super cute. So you guys have fun, happy crafting. I'll see you next time.